All right, we got our oil pump installed. Next thing is the what's called a worm gear. Uh, that's kind of a wire item. Uh, you'll burn these up ever so often. There's one. Uh, the gears melt away. It's kind of a shear point. If you have uh, real cold engine oil, uh, sometimes that'll shear them, sometimes just wire. Uh, something goes wrong with a pump, that'll shear to keep from breaking something else. But anyway, uh, that goes in. And uh, left hand threads, so you'll kind of like back, uh, putting it in backwards. Uh, scatter shield, in case the clutch blows up, I suppose. Goes in right like that. Uh, then the clutch. Uh, you'll notice it's got a hex side. You want that facing out so that you can take it off. And again, left hand threads. So uh, take note of where that arm is at because you'll have to slip uh, this groove in the clutch drum over the end of that arm. So let's notice where that's at. I think I see it pointing straight up. Uh, clutch drum bearing with grease. And I do run Molly assembly lube on that as well. And the drum itself. Uh, and then this little washer here. I uh, can't remember the proper non clamature non clamature proper word, if you will. It goes next. Well, no, your sprocket goes next. Got to have that on there. Dry the chain. Sprocket goes next. Then uh, that little piece there. I can't remember what that's called. Somebody will chime in and then the E clip. Uh, keep your fingers on that and maybe it won't fly away. That's also another good thing to keep extra on hand of. Several ways to put those on. Okay, maybe you heard that snap. There we are. Okay, hopefully everything's hooked up correctly. Uh, We'll mount the bar and chain, etc. and so on. Uh, thank you for watching.